All right, kindergartners, today what I wanted to have you do, I have a challenge for you, another one of these musical math challenges. I wanted you to write your own song using a little bit of musical math. So we talked about this a little bit last week. These measured lines or bar lines split us up into groups of four. Typically it's four. Sometimes it's two, sometimes it's three, sometimes it can be up to like 10. We're going to work in groups of four. I want you to create your own measures of music. I want you to create two different measures of music using any combination of these notes. You know whole notes are worth four. Dotted halves are worth three. Regular halves are worth two. Quarter notes are worth one. Quarter rests are also worth one. I want you to use any combination of these notes, making sure each of these boxes add up to four. Okay, so it's a little bit of math, a little bit of music. That's my challenge for you today, creating your own music. Bonus points if you come up with a song name. I usually don't come up with song names for you folks. I would love it if you came up with some song names for yourself. It can be about the seasons, it can be about the weather, it can be about your cat, I don't know. <laughs> so again, adding up different notes to get four. There's so many different combinations you can come up with. You might have the same combination as, a, as a, one of your classmates, and that's okay. As long as you are creating different combinations of four, all right? Send me your answers on Seesaw. You can draw it out. You can send me a picture. I would love to see your songs, all right? Y'all are going to be composers writing your own music. How exciting. I'll see you next week. Can't wait to see your songs.